yo this is the guy that everyone has been hounding me for they're like yo when's the steve guy coming now i'm like yo just chill wait on it it's coming all right we're gonna do it today now with this guy yeah i'm just gonna make it very very clear again he's like how wang how is one of the harder characters to use so steve is mainly about a poking at least he's a poking kind of like trying to fish for a count it type of character so i'm just gonna show you a couple things with him um what stage do we want to go for let's go for this stage so again kishan shout out to kishan as well ex soldier he's helped me out with a couple of things with steve as i'm not really a steve player so i'm just gonna let you know what stuff you can do what stuff are good what stuff i learned on i'll show you the stuff that i've learned on first and then go to kishan's uh advice and then I will show you the sample combos and his throws. So, you know, he has apparently six different stances. Six different stances. So, he has... For loads, he has down one. Down back two. Sorry, down back two. Which is cool. He also has... One, one, two. That's... Oh, that's gonna be... That's gonna be your with punish. Well, not your with punish, right? Your 10th frame. Uh, he has uh Yeah, he's got loads of different things, man. I need to teach you. So he has down for two to duck cancel. So it'll be like that. So down for two into uh forward X. So you can't do it for beer forward so like that. On counter hit it's safe. Right, hold on. Let me see. So I don't know. Oh man, they're making me want to learn Steve. So down forward, two into that. So, let's just say on counter. Let's make things easier. Can't bother to keep charging up all the time. All right, players rage off. We don't want rage off. Not set. Not set. Oh now the PS4 sounding like it wants to take off again. Bloody hell. Bloody hell. This is why I'm on PC, mate. All right, so counter hit. Okay, so down forward two. Oops, sorry. This is your move to scoop up, so. Sorry. Maybe it doesn't work, I don't know. Doesn't seem like it works. So maybe it would have to be. Yeah, it's, Steve is a hard character, I'll be honest. I'm only gonna I'm only gonna learn Kishan's tips to tell you guys what you could do. He has this as well, which is good. So that's up up four two. And then you can do four two one and then hold and then hold back and then do one down one. So I'll do it again one more time. This combo is quite easy. You could do that one which I didn't do I didn't I just pressed one 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 for flicker starts. Flicker starts is this. And that's usually the pickup down to two to two one. So that would be like the kind of like if you're close to the wall, that would be the wall carry kind of. So he has down four one plus two, which Sonic Fang uh, is is the go to for with Punisher, which is this. Back two, a normal hit is a Punisher for mid. Okay. Peekaboo 2 is high, safe crushes, gets juggle on counter hit and beats uh, punches like Bruce's 4-4-2 so, so this uh okay so that's nice Peekaboo again down forward it's delayable and safe like that you could do it slow uh safe mid mid and mix up for down forward one two which knocks down and gives free okie but high so in peekaboo you could do one you could do one down forward one one or one two which knocks down 
Duck extended into four two gives a free uh, free duck four two mad plus. Okay, okay. So let me show you this one. Not on counter here. Not set. We're gonna. This is what he's talking about. So stand guard. If you do this and you hold it and you hit a hurt by that time, press two. And if they block it, you get a free two. If you do it straight away again, look. So. Like that, you have to do it straight away. After you block the first one, you have to do it straight away. You could miss it. Yeah, it has to be straight away. That it doesn't matter if you if, if you this is basically a little, it's a like a little setup. You know, you could duck this first one anyway. Just it's a hide. Do you know what I mean? All right, now from flicker, flicker you can do by pressing back three plus four. Yeah. Now from this he does down one one, which is a good poke. Flicker again. They have to, they obviously you have to die they're both high. Flicker back two has arm and gives three four four two. Okay, so let's take it off standing guard. Again, I don't know these characters properly. I had a, I had a go with them and I find them extremely difficult. So I I went for advice. You know, there's nothing wrong with asking them. I had to. I just don't know these characters that well. Like I tried and yeah, the tips that I knew and stuff I knew. Yeah, I wanted to make sure that it was better for you. So from Flicker stance, he has back two into three four two four two. So back two into that. So. Yeah. Peekaboo forward forward one plus two. He has a good down forward two, but it's not it's not that punishable. So it's like that is good. So to do that, that's down forward two, and to do the rest is one two one one two one. So Steve Lowe's are a few because they're not that good. Uh, down back three two. Yeah, this one. I'm at 3 2. Down 2 1. If you duck, cancel is safe. So, yeah, so. Duck cancel is just doing forward 3 as well. Full crouch down forward 1, which is this. P uh, goes into peekaboo, and you could do down back 2. No, down back 1. It's like a panic thing. Okay, so. If I do, he's in, he's in peekaboo again. And then he's got down back two, which is this. And he has three plus four down two. So that's the spin. Down two. So you could just, you could just do that. You could, it's a, it's a nice little mix up. You could either do that two or uh, down or down two. I don't know why it's doing that. There we go. I think I'm pressing it twice. There we go. So peekaboo is forward. It's forward one. Peekaboo is forward three plus four. Flicker is back three plus four. And the general rule is, if you do certain moves, you either hold forward for peekaboo like that, or you hold back for flicker like that. So to keep momentum. You know what I mean? So, look, if I do it like that and not do anything, look, he's not in stance. But if I do hold back, he's in stance. If I hold forward, he's in stance. He said 2 1 could go into both. Uh, 2 1 could go into both. Okay, so 2 1, I'm in peekaboo. 2 1, I'm in back, I'm in flicker. Uh, back 1, he said, can go into flicker. Yeah? Back 1 is really strong on counter hit. So, back 1 on counter hit, look. And then you could do whatever else. So remember, this is like the second time I'm playing Steve, so I'm gonna show you now. Look, see? It's not hard to learn that part. And this is the thing, because he has so many different stances, is you have to kind of learn which ones are good for you. So I so far when I first picked him up, I just learned how to do flicker and peekaboo. Peekaboo he has a throw. I, I don't even need to look at the, what he's told me about that. I know that he has this throw as well. So for pressure, you could just literally just be like, you know what? 
grab one plus two you know trick people so then he goes on to say but all stances can go into go in go into ducking so you can be in flicker and just do forward free and it will go okay so if i'm in this forward free if i'm in peekaboo forward free yeah or you could do forward four it's entirely up to you do you know what I mean? So it's pre it's pretty good. You could duck off of one one, uh, one two, four two one, or oh, that was peekaboo, or down four one, down two one duck, down four two duck, and ducking four two could go straight into could go could go straight into back into ducking. So said forward two or you could do into ducking again okay so I think that's pretty much it in terms of like learning the stuff in terms of the stances I'll show you through the moves list and just the certain ways how you can find the stances this guy has a lot of moves so Those are the basics that I taught you, Steve. The basics. The al the album combination. Okay. Okay. It's the throw. Okay, yeah, this is well, quarter circle forward. This is a good move, a nice mid. He's got the uh, the toe kick as well. I didn't really want to teach the toe kick to be honest. Oh, that's a nice slow as well. It can be seen though, to be honest. And this is ah, oh, this is a good pressure tool. All right, so basically, he has this as well as a launcher for a full crouch launcher. He has down four two. So if he does, and then he could do, do that to keep the old that to keep the oki so. You could just probably do down one just to check him or even just do down for one to see if he's going to do a get up kick so again like i said he's, he's he's hard but i don't want you lot to rush into this character this character is he needs the he needs like you know like when you have a plant and you put the seed in and you throw the water it doesn't grow straight away it's kind of like steve steve is one of them characters that you have to pay attention to and you have to kind of understand the new stuff that he had like he has some new stuff from um Tekken Tag 2 and he also I would say stance cancelling can be a bit of a can be a problem cheap shot as well yes that's pretty much what I just showed you now that's a good while punish uh, while standing punishment as well and the running low as well Alright, let me show you some of the grabs that he has as well. He has a taunt as well. That's if you don't want to feel fancy and you don't feel like you don't want to do your thing. That's cool. So he has a nice little taunt. Um, I'm not showing you his tenet combo. I don't think it's, pro I think it's pointless. That's his arm break into a, pretty much, I'd say, a T uh, C-plex. Does damage. He has a punch parry as well. If you do that, you can press forward two and it does an uppercut. Was it forward? I can't remember. I forget. So look at that combo alone. That's two hits. And yeah, there we go. So as you can see at the there, it says it says press back to hold the flicker. See. Ooh, these combos look hard. See, look how we can catch him from that. That's crazy. Crazy. So, again, like I said, uh, his rage drive, I just don't know. And I, I, I do believe it's one of the worst in the game, if I'm honest. But I just don't know. I don't know if anyone else can vouch for me. I've, it's not really good at all. I don't see how it's good.
I don't even know how to do I'm being honest. Look. I don't know how to do Oh, because I'm not in rage drive. Right, whoops. Play rage. Um, I don't know how you're ever going to capture someone like that. It's only if you can see them doing a move and then you whiff and you can see them whiff. That's the only time. But the character's good. You just have to you just have to know the stances. Like he has that sway back. Uh the, uh, the way the kind of like I I like to call it the wave dash. It's not really a dash, it's just like a see and if you could if you hold it, he has that. He has the sway. He's pretty he's a very good character, man. Again, it's it's one of them characters you just have to sit down and proper learn with. And even just learn just learn the combos as well. And most of the time it gets the wall if you if you get if you get like wall damage and stuff like that. It's down one plus two. There are other combos that are difficult, but again, like I said, this is the basic pro guide. This is a basic guide on how to learn how to use Steve. In the next one, where it's gonna have Steve again, it's gonna have the more the, the frame punishes and stuff like that. So yeah, make sure you guys keep your eyes peeled for that. If you don't like this, give it a thumbs up leave a comment down below and make sure you guys keep it locked man stay tuned there's gonna be a lot more tutorials coming we've only got like a couple characters left but we're gonna get it man i'm telling you we're gonna get it but other than that guys take it easy man peace i remember that i'll be streaming as well